Hello and welcome everyone to anubavtrainings.com. In this episode of SAP Analytics Cloud Tutorial for Planning, we will learn about data actions in SAC planning. Data actions are very important aspects when you want to perform complicated calculations as well as changes to your data set or copy data set from one version to another version with the click of a button. These data actions are centrally defined and can be executed on any target version in SAP Analytics Cloud. So let me switch it over to the system to explain you an example of data action. So what I've got here is a story where I have the headcount data of employees for actual version 2017. Now my requirement is to copy all this actual headcount data which I have it across 2017 including hirings, openings and terminations. Make a copy of this entire data to my another version. So what I've done already, I went ahead to the version management and I've created a copy called plan 2018 version from my actual version. As you can see, my new plan 2018 version which I've created, I don't have for year 2018 any hiring or termination or opening and closing balance data for headcounts. Now what I've done is I've gone ahead and I've created a data action under Home menu, Create, Process and Data Action. So this is where I went ahead and created a copy data action. So what I will do now is I will go ahead and include that copy data action in my story. So I can click on plus button and I will say data action trigger. And now I have got a data action over here. I can give a name so I can say copy data of headcount from 2018 or 2017. And I'll just go ahead and choose my data action name. The name of that action which I've created was init plan. And now I will just, um, when somebody clicks on this data action, what should happen? I would want it to give a prompt for the target version where the system has to perform the data action. And I'll say, I can also fix the value or I can give a prompt. And in the prompt, I will default the value of my plan 2018 version. I click on save my story. And now watch out when my data action triggers, it's going to make a copy of all my headcount data from year 2017 for the actual version to my 2018 plan version. So I can go back and now I can just click on this button and observe what exactly it does. So you can see it gives me a pop up and says where do you want to carry out your data action on which version. It's already pre-populated and I just say run. And what's happening now system is going to make a copy of all my 2017 actual data to my 2018 plan version. You can see it has got me all my data copied from that version to this version. So that's the beauty and that's the benefit you get when you use data actions. With a click of a button, different calculations can be carried out. So there are two broad type of data actions you can create in Analytics Cloud. One is a copy data action or another is a scripted data action for more complicated calculations. Now, if I would like to, for some reason, roll back this change, I can always go back to the version management. That's the benefit you get when you have the version management in place in your system. So let's go back to the version and I can switch over to the plan version and I'll look at the history of this version. And you can see I've just executed a data action about a couple of seconds ago. I can just go back to the previous version and I can um, close. So you can see again, my system has rolled back the version to the last table state. Again, I can click and perform the executions to carry out my data copy from 2017 actual version to the planned version accordingly. And once again, as you can see on the screen, the data gets copied. So this is just a quick view and preview of how data actions works and what do they really do. For complete detailed training on data actions, creating them in the system step by step, going through the real time scenarios of planning, including allocations, data actions, distributions, spreading allocations, please subscribe my training on SAP Analytics Cloud on anubotrainings.com and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.